but then I said that all the hate was making everything black. Probably subconsciously racist in some way. Ashley, you're not racist. I don't have any black friends. What does that say? I don't have any black friends either. What does that say? It says that we are bad and people. That's what it says. Well, enough about us. Let's talk about you. I don't want to talk about me anymore. Ashley, just call her back and apologize, man. Girls don't grow in trees, okay? I mean- Oh, what's the point? I don't know if I want to spend the rest of my life with somebody so overly political anyway. Mark, I just finished reading this amazing Candy Russell poem. It's about solitude, loneliness, I feel like she was writing it to me, man. I think you're sending her one of my books. Which one do you think I should send? Yeah, man, send them all. Honestly, it can't hurt. Send, send every one of them. Great girl that I liked once, you know? Oh, it really sucks, man. And it's like, I can't bear to live my life alone. Hey, I ain't gonna call it six tonight. Do you mind staying in the room? Uh, yeah, sure. It's not like I have a life or anything, is it? Gentle readers, I'm proud to announce I've been on my first long distance relationship with none other than a published Bush scholar I've really fallen for. His book was a profound revelation and I'm excited to be meeting him in person at last this week. I'll be flying to the East Coast. I just finished purchasing a ticket for this Tuesday. I wanted a 10 a.m. flight. Oh, but first class wasn't available, so I booked the 6 p.m. instead. Well, he'll pick me up and give me a personal tour. I can't believe I'm in love at last. It's true what they say. You can't hurry love. Damn you, Kermit Wexler. Damn you! Bush is an asshole. He's a chemical drug user and a moralistic ex-drunk. He's fucked up everything he's ever done in his life. If he didn't come from such a rich, affluent, wealthy-ass family, he'd be a fucking failure and a poverty-stricken, welfare drunk! You're an idiot, Kermit Wexler. Your book sucks. I haven't even read it and it sucks. You suck! Nice. I like this. You know what? I kind of like it, too. Yeah, I like this side. You know what we should do now? What? We should burn the fucking book. Yeah! Yeah, let's, let's burn, burn this! Burn this book? Yeah. Burn the fucking book! Yeah! yeah. Let's burn this! Yes! Yes! Oh! Ah! 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 Yes. This is how the Nazis dealt with books they disagreed with. Well, guess what, Kermit? If it's good enough for Hitler, it's good enough for me, too. You can fucking have Allison. God, how did the Nazis do this? I never want to see Allison ever again! 
think they had like torches or flamethrowers. God, they or... must have had a bonfire. I saw that in Indiana Jones 3, wasn't it? Who makes these goddamn lighters anyway? Ah, oh, there it goes. Damn you, Kermit Wexler. Damn you. I feel like I'm Farley Moe here. Come on, baby. Oh, God, how do they fucking, how do you burn a book? I should ask Sean Connery. You know what? Can you hold this, please? Yes. You know what? I never want to see Allison again. Yeah. I never want to see another conservative ever again either. Yes. High five it. <laughs>